Welcome to another edition of the most consistent, prolific, and dedicated uploads in YouTube history. This is the Dynamic Show View Entertainment on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe. You know, I've been receiving a lot of comments, a lot of messages from my subscribers. Sean, when are you going to care about us? When are you going to answer our questions? When, you're when are you going to be social again? Well, I'm going to level up in interaction because I want to take your comments, your questions, your suggestions, your complaints, all in the comment section below. So I'm going to do five questions or it could be pertaining to questions comments complaints suggestions whatever it is whatever you want to add whatever you want to multiply whatever you want to subtract them showing you David, you want me to talk about it and you, you want the issue to be resolved or whatever it is leave it in the comment section below i'll take five the best five but remember if your question or complaint or comment doesn't get answered in one video don't worry it could be answered in another video so so keep them coming as i will read all questions comments concerns complaints uh and whatever you want to throw at me Brandon16 from Rhode Island asks, Will you ever return and do Raw reviews? I personally miss these from you. I would also like if you could review NXT and SmackDown to add more depth to your reviews. Personally, I like the way you go about your reviews and get right to the point like in your news and rumor videos. Keep on going on, Sean's View Entertainment. Well, thank you, Brandon, uh, for your question uh, and your comment and your suggestion. Um, I know I've been you know, laying a little low because I've been doing so many videos. I've been putting so much passion and heart and enthusiasm between rumors, news, and headlines. It's been very chaotic. It's been ver very busy, although, of course, today hasn't been all that busy. But you know, you're going to get days where it's slow. But um, yes, I will do Raw reviews. I will do NXT reviews and SmackDown right now. I was just laying low on that. I was trying to let other channels... Uh, get an opportunity. I was trying to give other app, uh, channels in, uh, a window for them to grow and give th get their review out there. And I didn't want to just you know be stingy and just do raw reviews and take up all the views. So I just wanted to leave room for other YouTubers to get their raw review out there, so they know that you know there are, there are other people on here besides Sean V Entertainment. It's all about helping. It's all about extending. I'm not all about myself. Everyone thinks I'm for myself on this website. I want to see people expand. I want to see people grow. It's not just all about Sean V Entertainment. It's about my subscribers. It is about my viewers. It is about the whole damn picture. It is about seeing other YouTubers grow. So, yes, I will be doing Raw, SmackDown, and NXT reviews in due time in the coming weeks. Maybe, personally, I might start next week again. John from Cali says, Sean, I know you and Enter the Arena's YouTube channel hate each other. And have not seen eye to eye on too many occasions. And at one time, Enter the Arenas bullied you and tried to put you out of commission on YouTube. Not only that, but they tried to put you in jail. How do you feel now that they recently lost over 5,000 subscribers on their channel? They must be so embarrassed because they have resorted to hiding their subscriber count because it has went down that much. I also wanted to know what is your current relationship with that channel? Well... I feel that, you know, into the arenas, I don't really watch them. I don't view them. I could give two craps about them. But you know what? It's a loss. It's terrible. It's harsh. It's bad. Um, but they, ex you know what? They deserve everything that happens to them. You see, they took an incident and blew it way out of proportions. They tried to make me look like the bad guy. They took video upon video ranting on me and talking about my manhood. Talking about my man parts kept going on and on about it and they were making no mistake about it they were bullying me i didn't do nothing to them i didn't chastise them i didn't call them names i didn't pull out their trump card i didn't do any of those things but now to see that they once had twenty-eight thousand subscribers and now they have a mere twenty-three thousand subscribers now they know what it's like they know that Sean's View Entertainment is the one place destination for all WWE news, rumors, headlines, previews, predictions. And they wish that all those people on that channel combined could be half as passionate and half as motivated and half as dedicated as Sean's View Entertainment. You see, I could care less about that channel. The mere fact that you asked me a question or brought, out, brought up a comment about them, whatever bad happens to them, they had it coming. You know, there's an old saying... What goes around comes around. They tried to get me off of YouTube. They tried to get me in jail. They tried to make the cops arrest me. They don't know the facts. They don't know anything. They blow something that is so, something so simple. Something that wasn't really that big of a deal. Although, at the time, people really blew it out of proportion. Okay? But I'm not going to go back to that time. I've moved on. I've progressed. I've advanced my channel. I have made the proper adjustments. But Enter the Arenas is going to learn that you don't mess with Sean's View Entertainment. Don't, don't get into a battle that you can't win. 
because I will never lose. I will never go away. And I don't care how many rants. I don't care how many chants. I don't care how many bully videos they want to put up of me. The fact of the matter is this. They will never beat me. They can talk about that incident that happened so long ago. Over and over and over until... Well, the WWE Network. Remember the 999, 999, 999. All they can do is talk about that one incident and one incident only. And that's all they can talk about. So I hope they lose all their subscribers because I never did anything to them. I never called them. I never called the cops on them. I never wanted to sue them. I had no complaints. I had no concerns. I had no problems with them. They started it and I, well, it, I ended it. It's done. It's over. It's in the past. It's water underneath the bridge empty the arenas wants to go head up one-on-one -on -one, mono -e mono man to man with the most consistent prolific and dedicated uploads in youtube history sean's entertainment they will never match my consistency they will never see my passion they will never levitate to me because they don't know they don't understand what it takes to be me and what i go through on this very channel so empty the arenas you lost over 4,000, 5,000 subscribers, whatever it is. You now have resorted to hiding your subscriber count because you know it's embarrassing that you lost such a substantial amount of subscribers. You know, it's funny because at one time I lost a, sub a substantial amount of subscribers, but I gained them back in a day, in one day, because that's what Sean Entertainment is all about. You got a group of people on your channel. I am a one-man army on my channel, and I've... One I, you know, here's the great thing about this. I was on YouTube... After they were on YouTube. They were on YouTube in 2010, right? They started their channel in 2010. I started my channel in 2012, which means it was later than them, and I still have more subscribers than they do. So what does that tell you? I'm done with that channel. I'm done with the people that are on that channel. I hate the people that represent that channel. I'm not about them. They started a war, and they, they lost the war. I'm still here, and look at them. Look where they are now. Lost so many subscribers. Good for them. Aaron from te Texas asks, what did you think of Raw last night? Well, what did I think of Raw last night since I didn't give my Raw review? I thought it was decent. I thought it was okay. I thought it could have been a lot better. I thought the writing was subpar. I thought it was piss poor. I think the 999 overhype in the network was just horrible. It was tragic to see that the WWE was regulated to doing those kind of things and those kind of tactics. It, it was just... It was almost... I mean, it was, it was funny. The first few times that Triple H plugged in the 999, it was funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But after that, it, it, it was just sad. It's, I, I don't even want to talk about it, to tell you the truth. But, but thank you for your question. Now, Andy from Connecticut says, Sean, I just want to compliment you on staying away from talking and ranting and focusing on haters, trolls, and skeptics. And that little rant that I just did on Enter the Arenas, I didn't say anything bad about them. I didn't call them any names. I just said that they had what was coming to them. And that's the bottom line. Now, Thomas says, I just want to know, will you be getting WWE 2K15 Will we get gameplay on your channel, and what console will you be getting it on? Well, I did have PS3, but I learned that the My Universe mode and the career mode will not be on PS3 versions, so I am going to get the PS4. I will get 2K15. You will get gameplay. You will get commentaries. You will get Sean Dream Entertainment as motivated and enthusiastic as it's ever been because this is what Sean Dream Entertainment is and what it's all about, and ain't nobody going to stop me. Thank you for all your questions, your comments, your concerns, your complaints. And remember, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, complaints, suggestions, make sure to leave it in the comments section below. That is the only way I will get back to you. Remember, if you want to leave your name, your age, your state, or just your YouTube channel, do that. So do it now. Hit me up. And uh, the more questions and comments and concerns and suggestions I get, the more videos of these I will do. You'll be interactive with me, and I'll answer you. Subscribe.